everybody welcome back to my channel so today is a different type of video than what I usually do today is a what I got for Christmas haul so the first thing I'm going to show you I got from my uncle and it's these enchanted roses and they're like super beautiful and like have this like dusted glitter thing on them to be honest I don't know what it's called he called it something but I don't remember at the moment we'll see how long they last because I'm not really a pet person or pet a plant person so we'll see the next thing I got is this little beautiful book it's just like an empty book you write in but it's like super pretty I think it's just gorgeous then I got some popcorn a dish rag thing um and this to like put stuff in right now I just have some candies in it and this little book thing then I got a K-cup thing. That's the attachment for the K-cup. This is for ground coffee. Then I got a t-shirt. That's orange, which is my favorite color, by the way. Then I got this super fluffy, soft as hell blanket. Um, we're going to move that back onto the bed. Then, yay! Sorry about that, guys. Then, oh, I'm so itchy. My big present this year was this Cook's coffee maker. It's a single serve coffee maker. And this has like, does K cups and like actual brews. So then I got this Prevail like 86 piece makeup case. So, came with eyeshadows and stuff. Then these things on the side pull out. And the first one is like lipstick, I believe. Hold on. Is like bronzers, blushes. You can use these as eyeshadows too. I actually really like these. The like maker or like the case is super nice actually. Like I actually really like it. Then it came with like two or three lipsticks or like lip glosses. And then one with a bunch of lipsticks or lip glosses, I should say. They both sides have a, a camera, not a camera, a mirror in them. And then I got ee, a bunch of K cups. So this one is one of them. It has Colombian, bre uh, Arabic, Brefix blend, French roast, French vanilla, and milk chocolate in this. And then I also got one little thing. Ee, of um what's it called oh i also got this jacket from my granny she's the best but i also got pumpkin spice ones and peppermint mocha and like smaller ones but i've already used like 90 percent of them to be honest so that's pretty much all i got for christmas this year a two close friends of mine are also sending christmas presents through the mail but i have not got them yet um and then i also got sensors for my mom which is really cool because like i've been wanting sensors for my pump for a while um, and then I also got this really cool cup. Um, I actually got it a little before Christmas, but I love it. So it's cool. Um, anyways, guys, that's pretty much, oh, I should probably show you the, hold on. I'm going to show you the, and here is the coffee pot. So this, let me move my setting spray. This comes up and you put the K cup in this, then you close it. And then it has the different sizes right here. And you can do capsule or ground coffee. And then here's like the water tank. So that's pretty much it for Christmas. Hold on. Okay, guys, before we get into this, I just want to let you know that this part of the video was filmed after the first part. So it's about three days after Christmas. And my boyfriend, oh, excuse me, uh, let me uh, get some makeup for Christmas. So we decided to go to the Jewelry Box here in El Paso. There's actually like, I think, four or five locations, surprisingly. But I don't know where else Jewelry Box is located. I believe it's just in Texas. But more or less, it's very similar to Shop Miss A. They do like six items for $5.50. Oh, excuse me. So that's just kind of like how it went. So here's the packaging for the brushes I'm going to show you. Yeah, you can kind of see that. So, um, I didn't realize it, but I got three of the same brush, which I'm, like, super happy about, weirdly enough. I apologize for Spike. He's a dick. But anyways, so the first three brushes I'm going to show you are all the exact same. 
So this is the Amore Us Pro Makeup Small Blending Brush 923. So this is how it looks. Let me put the other two down. So I did get three of these. They remind me of the Wet n Wild brushes for like, the. I think they do like $2 or something like that. But they're really soft. Like I'm very surprised at how soft these are. Um, so yeah, I got those three, and then the three other ones are different. The first one is a Pro Makeup Small Shader Brush, the 911. And this is just like a flat, like thicker consistency, like to maybe do concealer, whatever. I needed a new one because the one I have kind of sucks. But anyways, um, then the Pro Makeup Blending 907. And it's just like circular, and it's just a blending brush, so... And then the last one is a crease brush, I guess. But I was thinking more of like a pencil brush. Like if you look at that shape. Like I, I really like them. They're all very soft and stuff like that. So are these? Yeah, they're all a dollar. So next we're going to go into the stuff that was not a dollar. So I haven't been to... <coughs> I apologize. I am a little sick. I haven't been to Joy Box in a long time. So they do have beauty creations there, um, a bunch of like sites or a bunch of stores that they didn't have before. But anyways, this is the Amuse Light Illuminating Primer. If I can get the dang thing open. Oh, I'm just going to wait it. Okay. So this is by Amuse Cosmetics. I don't know if you can find it anywhere else. I can't tell you that. Ooh, wow. That's that's beautiful packaging. So this was $3.49. Ooh, wow. This is like really pretty. So this is what we got. It's a really pretty glass bottle. Ooh. Ooh, wow. That is a nice consistency too. Ooh, wow. It doesn't smell like anything. Oh, wow. Okay, that is... It just kind of adds a sheen to the skin. It feels super soft, though. Like, wow. I was scared that it was going to be, like, glittery or something. But... So, next... <laughs> oh, my eyeshadow brush is rolling away. But next, we have four palettes. So, these are all different prices, pretty much. There's, like, two that are the same. So, these are $6.99 each. These are both by Amore Us. Actually, I think they're all by Amore. Oh, no, one isn't. Okay. So, the first one is Love You A Latte. I'm a very... So, the names... Ooh, wow. Okay, so the names are on the back of both. And this is a cruelty-free brand, I guess. That's nice. It's pretty, um, ooh, and it tells you, like, the names on the back and what type of finish they are, so that's cool. Ooh, that, I can't wait to play in that shade. Okay, so, here is the first palette. Hold on. There is the first palette. I apologize that this is so messy. You can kind of see it like that. So there is the first palette. It's really pretty. I really like the sugar shade. Obviously. And it is called Sugar. Ooh, and I just noticed they also have the names written on the bottom of, like, the thing of the carton. The packaging feels pretty nice. Like, it's obviously cardboard, but it's not, like, super cheap feeling. So, I mean. Next, we have Glamour Shot. And this one, I love the packaging on it. It's so beautiful. Like, I really liked it. Ooh, and this one even comes with a protector, it looks like. And to be honest, I honestly just picked this one for the shimmer shades in here. Like, all of these shades are freaking gorgeous. Um, they're shimmer. There's like three mattes, but they're metallic and foils, and they're like... They're freaking gorgeous. Okay, it's chill. What is chill? Okay, so chill is a foiled... Oh my god, it's freaking glitter. It's like straight up glitter. 
Ooh, wow. That is freaking gorgeous. Okay, so it's literally just glitter is what the foil shades are. But anyways, this one is so pretty. I just, I had to buy it, honestly. Like, I don't have anything like this. I've never really played with foiled shadows before. So I'm, I'm pretty excited about this one. Like, I can't wait to, like, play with it. <laughs> okay, so next is Shine Bright by Amore Us again. It seems like most of the stuff I bought is either, like, a more is, like, most of it's a more us, I guess. Oh, one of the thingies got broke. Okay, that's fine. Ooh, their shimmer shades are super smooth. So it looks like like something dug in a little bit to this, and I didn't notice it before. But this has a bunch of mattes and metallics as well. This one has a little more mat or mattes than... I really like the charm shade that is, like, bright orange. They have a mustard yellow. So it has this bottom row and up this side that are all, like, metallics, I guess. Yeah, they're all metallics. But this packaging is freaking gorgeous. Look at that. It's so pretty. And these are all 15 pan shades. So, I mean, like, that's a pretty good deal. Like, $6.99, like, yes. Yeah, I believe all four of the palettes are $6.99, so. And they all come with, like, sleeves and stuff. Like, they're all really good packaging, like, wise. <clears throat> so, the next one is... Prismatic by Prolux. So this one again comes with a sleeve. And then this one is like a different... Ooh, wow, that is beautiful. Okay, so here is my last palette. Wow, that is just, they're like, oh my gosh, they're like straight up freaking glitter. Like, that is so cool. I really like the mattes that they have in this, though. So they have two mattes over here, three here, and one here, and they're all like hella pretty. But to be honest, I'm most excited about playing with these orange shimmer shades. Like, they're so beautiful. Ooh, and they have names on this thing. Okay, so DGAF, Rub, Crush, and probably Millennial look like they're going to be really nice. So here it is, guys. Um, okay. So we have all those. Now is into the lip products. Because guys, I bought a lot. Actually, we have two more shades real quick. Or shadows. So these are the Malibu Glitz um, Metallic Shadows. And the first one I got is in White Pearl. And the second is in Pine Tree. So one's a white and one is a green. I've really been into green shades since Christmas. Like, yeah. Okay. Ooh. Okay, so the first thing I got is a Holographic px or it's holographic long lasting lipstick and then it's by px look and the cap is like hella pretty guys like honestly it's really pretty so it seems to be like decent packaging i mean Ooh, wow so it's not necessarily like super metallic i would say or holographic even it really puts off like a white green shade. I don't know if I'd call that holographic, but it's pretty. I want to see how it does with a long lasting lipstick. Oh, my cat is an idiot. So anyways, next I got, if I can open the darn things. I got a bunch of these, so I'm going to show you each shade, I guess. Um, so the first shade is like a light pink and it's July. This next one is May. Oh 
Okay. So, guys, these are all matte liquid lipsticks. So, okay, so I guess only some of these have shade names. Okay, then. So, we're going to go ahead and swatch these and show them to you. So, this first one is, like, a dark, like, purple, I want to say. Okay. Oh, wow. That's, like, a deep plum. That is so pretty. And these are all Amuse Matte Liquid Lipsticks, by the way. Next is just a nude shade. And this one doesn't have a name either. The packaging does feel a little cheap. It's not bad, but it does feel a little cheap. I really like how it looks, though. Like, See, you can see the color there. <sighs> okay, next is a red shade, like a deeper red, I guess. Yeah. Ooh, that's... That's like hella pretty. Wow. That is freaking gorgeous. And then next we have three pinks. So this is May, May and July. So they're both like pinky colors. They're both nudes, more or less. So this one's like a bubblegum pink and this is July. Then we have May, which is more like a dusty rose pink, I would say. I really like both of these, though. They're really pretty. And then lastly, this one is, like, so pretty. Like, this is probably my favorite shade. This one is Lip in 4, apparently. So, that's all the Amuse ones. They're super pretty. Like, I'm actually really happy with that. Okay, guys. So, now we have two Amuse cosmetic lipsticks. Are these Amuse as well? No. Okay. So, they're the matte liquid lipsticks. They come in this type of packaging, which is, I think, decent, I guess. So, we have C5 and C4, and they're, like, literally completely different colors. Ooh, wow. This is, like, a brown, like, a chocolate brown. And then this is C5. Ooh, that is pretty. Okay, so here is C4 and C5. And then we have some lip liners. We got five of them. To be honest, most of these are just nude colors because I needed some more nude lipsticks. These are Cara... Uh, lip pencils and they're this first one is coral reef there's the first one it's just a nude so that I can line my lips for it that I'm like lipstick the next one is natural kiss they're a little stiff but that's how I like my lip my uh, my lip liners you could even use these as lip or uh, eyeliners if you really wanted to next is light salmon Okay, that's like orange, but so the next one is light, light salmon over here. It's literally like an orangey color. The next one is romantic rose. Ooh, that is nice. Next is romantic rose there, and lastly is just rose, and that's like a bright pink. And the last products we have are three PX Matte Long Lasting Lip Glosses, even though they're lipsticks. So the first one is number two. Ooh, that is pretty, actually. That reminds me a little of Mannequin by Jeffree Star. So there is number two. Then we have nine, yeah, nine and four. So four. Ooh, that's going to be pretty. This one's like a, just a plummy color. It's really nice. I really like all these formulas so far. Like that one completely dried down. And then lastly, they smell really good too, actually. Now, these ones, I don't know if they're going to dry down or not, but we will see. 
Okay, so, and there is the last one over here. It's like a, I don't know, but it's real nice. It's The ones on the top, the Amuse ones here, all dried down. Um, so, anyways, guys. Okay, guys, so that is all I got for Christmas this year. Comment down below and tell me what you guys got in the comments below or what your favorite gift was this Christmas season. Anyways, I wish you guys a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys!